I'm just gonna sit here for a moment just to see if y'all can pick up on what's different in this video. And then knowing I'm talking about my beard, even though that's new, your boy did a little shaving, shaving. I'm finna get ready to go back to Brazil in a few days, two days to be exact. Nigga, I cannot tell you how happy I am, how excited I am to get out this motherfucker, bro. But anyway, if you have not yet caught on to it, the quality of the camera is insane, right? I know I told you guys before now, I'm sure some of y'all probably, like, bro, this nigga ain't doing this shit. He ain't gonna do this shit. He ain't gonna do this shit. You lied, bro. And I know who you are. You know what I'm saying? I know you was counting me out. The quality is crisp, clear, 4K, 5K, 6K, whatever Ks. We got Ks. All right? The quality is stupid, dumb, bro. So what we gonna do, what we gonna do is we gonna make this quick little video. There's another upload that's taking forever to upload. I don't know why. But it's a little long video, but it's very important for the brothers to see. You know what I'm saying? So this one's gonna come out before that one. So this one is a good topic that a lot of people ask me. A lot of people are curious. Bro, how did you learn Portuguese so fast? And mind you, I am not fluent in Portuguese by no means. So I am not a fluent Portuguese speaker. But I can not walk into somebody and have a conversation, which is enough for, to do whatever you're trying to do. Right, so I got four different tips. Uh, number one is gonna be Google Translate. Everybody know Google Translate. Google Translate is a household name. It don't need no big ass introduction. It speaks for itself. You translate shit to a, one language to another, right? But what I would do is if I'm at the crib just chilling, I'd be on my phone. I wonder how you say such and such. And then I'll say, okay, how do I say, what are you doing today? And that'll be my my word or phrase of the day or the week. You know what I'm saying? I would, and then I also realize that you cannot, which, well, I know this, but a lot of you probably don't know this. The slang that we use, like for instance, no cap or that's cap. You cannot use that in Google Translate to translate it into Portuguese or whatever language because they don't use that slang, right? So even though a lot of people don't know that, that's really common sense, but it is what it is. So you can't use our slang into Google Translate and use it with them and for them to understand it because they're gonna be like, what? Trust me, I tried to do that shit on my own. <laughs> and it was like, what the fuck? Anyways, so Google Translate. Number two, invest in Tinder Gold. Uh, Tinder Gold is gonna be like your virtual passport. So that means you can put yourself, if you live in Dallas, you can put yourself in Brazil and start nat uh, networking and talking with chicks before you get there. Right. If you want to, I don't know how it's gonna work. I never tried it before, but you can open it up for guys and girls on Tinder. I don't recommend it, but you can do that and then start talking with guys and girls on Tinder. Um, you can do that if you want to. I don't know, I'm not gonna do it. But anyways, yeah, so start talking with Brazilians because the best way for you to learn any language is gonna be speaking with someone who is native from that country. If you're not able to be in that country, the second best way is to find ways to access them, which will be through the Tinder Gold, Facebook, Instagram, however it is, and start talking with these people. Um, because that's gonna give you the real, true, up-to-date language and lingo and slangs and all type of stuff. Because, and that brings me to my next point. The next one's gonna be Duolingo, of course, or any other um, language app. But the thing with that is, yes, it's very informative and very helpful. But it's like when people come to America and they're like learning English before they get here. It's like textbook English, the proper English. We don't talk like that on an everyday basis, right? We use slangs, broken English, all types of shit, right? So it's the same for Portuguese, right? And number four, I would say Portuguese while you sleep. People don't understand how important and how valuable and how precise and good it is, bro. Like, I remember I was listening to that shit for like two or three months straight while you sleep. You retain so much information while you sleep. That's how I do my personal development. Les Brown, Jim Rohn, Eric Thomas. When I got to Brazil, I was throwing out Portuguese like crazy and not realizing how the fuck am I speaking Portuguese so good? But subconsciously, you retain more information than when you are awake just walking around listening to shit, right? Portuguese while you sleep. Everything that I'm saying right now is gonna be in the links, in the description. Um, the videos of Portuguese while you sleep, I'll drop those down below as well. 
and the Patreon link is new. Just create the Patreon. This is about to get crazy, bro. I'm just letting y'all know that now. This is about to be the latest channel on goddamn YouTube, bro. So make sure y'all on board. Rocking with your boy. Cash App is down below. If you if you feel free in your heart, you know what I'm saying, to donate to your boy. Everything going for a good cause. Everything's going back into the content. Back for you guys. And yeah, man, we're going to keep rocking it, baby. So I appreciate you guys. Make sure y'all hit that goddamn like button, bro. It ain't, I ain't asking for no money to hit the like button, bro. If y'all fuck with me, hit the like button. Comment down below if you have some some different suggestions on how you guys learn different languages and shit like that. Because you can never learn too many ways to learn language, all right? You know what I'm saying? Because we're a family over here. We rock together. So comment down below. If you have not yet subscribed, subscribe, baby. We got this thing. Peace.